Hello, my name is Cameron Lindsay, and today I'm going to be giving you a quick show of my level I've been creating in Unreal Engine 4. So, the theme is of a spaceship that's just got um, under attack, or the engine's been blown up, and something's loose in the, uh, the spaceship. So, the warning lights are going off, uh, it's completely empty, no one's about. It's kind of meant to be a horror themed game. Um, so, I'm going to show you around, explain every room, um, what the bits are, and yeah, I hope you enjoy it. So we start off in this control room, uh, if you look out the window, you can see some stars, it's very dark, you need to try to get the power back on and avoid getting attacked by the alien that will be roaming around, the alien's not in at the moment. Um, so this is the main control panel. It's completely wrecked, there's sparks flying off everywhere, there's no way you can move. This control panel is inactive, it's not working. If we go up, we can go through these doors. And a quick thing to point out is we have a flashlight on us to help us see in this dark. Uh, because when the lights turn off, then it's completely bad. I can quickly show you. By pressing F, we can toggle on and off our flashlight. So here we go. And as you can see, when those lights go off, it is completely black. So I guess if you're wanting to play more on, you can like, turn off your flashlight and just go by these red lights. Um, makes it a little bit harder to see, a little bit more creepy. I'll soon turn it on, because it's easier to show you things with the flashlight on. So we go for this door. We go into like, a main room, I guess, with a table in the middle where the staff will eat and hang out, chill out with each other, um, some crates and barrels, probably of food, uh, supplies and such. And then if we go through this door, we will head towards the laboratory, and this is where things have gone wrong. This is where the creature has escaped and is now a foot in the um, spaceship using, as it feed, uh, using the spaceship as its feeding ground. So we go through here. We're welcome to the lab. Uh, it's got various bottles, um, some flasks, and uh, some microscopes and such, some chairs and tables, and then uh, some cupboards, which probably would have some chemicals in, and um, some barrels. If we go upstairs, this is where the creatures escaped. There's various containment chambers, as well as a quick view into the space. Um, there's a, mic a microscope and some bottles. Uh, and you can look inside these containment chambers and there is various things in them. An alien in this one. And uh, this one has been cracked open, some liquid pouring out of it, and yeah, we don't know what. Must be the alien. Must have escaped. So, um, we can go back out into this main central room. And then, if we go through this corridor, we're gonna head into the accommodation, the residential bit of the spaceship. And there's about four rooms, each with a, a double bed in the middle, two cupboards outside, big wardrobe here, and a desk with two computers on. Um, we go back out. Again, there's four of these rooms. Another one here, and another one here, and another one here. And then over here, this door is going to lead us into the armory, where obviously all the weapons are kept. So if we go in, we can see some various weapons hanging on the walls, some weapons on the uh, table, and of course a Stormtrooper mask and lightsaber, because you've got to keep in with that Star Wars theme. Um, and then again, some more guns, guns hanging on the walls, some droids here, um, some supplies in the corner, ammo crates, and some ammo stored into this cupboard. We head back out, we'll go back to that main corridor, um, main room even, in the middle. And then we'll head down here. So yeah, like I said, I think my game will probably, well this level will probably be based in a horror game, where you have to try to survive from an alien attacking you, and you have to do various objectives like turning back on the power or um, getting parts to fix the core reactor, which we're about to see. All well, the core reactors are a bit beyond repair, I think. We go over here, 
we greeted with a flaming uh, reactor, sparks flying off it, all the reactor cooling rods are on fire. It, it's a mess. I don't think you're going to be able to repair that anytime soon. Which is why the power's out, obviously, and why the ship can't move. If we go through here, there's a simple meeting room. Um, just with some computers, two tables, um, and some chairs. And uh, yeah, they would discuss, I guess, the next objective, where the fish is flying, and um, what they're going to do when they land on the planet. Over here, we come into the evacuation pod. However, the evacuation pod has uh, it's been destroyed. You can't use the control panel anymore. That's sparking and smoking. Um, but if we look out, we can see the spaceship or stars, a hangar down below, which we're going to visit next. Going out of this door, we back into this room, and the glowing platform in the middle is actually a lift. So we stand on this uh, small pad here, it's going to take us down to the hangar floor. Here we go. Using our torch, we can see there is tons of crates and some barrels here, full of supplies, some two cupboards here, and then of course the spaceships. But the door can't open because there's not enough power to open it, so these spaceships are pretty useless. We can go up these stairs onto a walkway, which has again has some more crates and barrels up here. This goes around for uh, maintenance, I presume. And yeah, that's pretty much all of what I've made. Um, I had a lot of fun making it. Um, it took quite a lot of time, but yeah, it was, it was good. I hope you enjoy my level. Um, I hope you enjoy the ideas I have for my level. Um, yeah, uh, see ya. And 